Healer. She's alive? Thought she was oh. Ash. She rises. <clears throat> Healer. Good. And your name? Blue? Promising. And where are we? Uh, where did you go? My eye. My eye. Well, aren't you all sorts of something? How long was I? The whole time, sister. Since the beginning. The beginning? When was the beginning? Who knows? Who cares? For us, it's only been eight hours. You mean I've been communing this whole time? Look, honey, I'll be blunt. I don't know you. But let me tell you how it looks from where I'm sitting. For years, we've been riding this train, working to piece things back together. And then, hours ago, you decided to set off a bomb. In one moment, you destroyed everything we've been working toward. What did you want with the ministers? That's not for you to know. I can tell you we didn't want them burnt to a crisp. We knew those sisters. I even birthed some of those sisters. They turned on you. Was that a good enough reason to torch them? If you knew what I had been through, you would have done the same. Are all miscellaneous like you? Watch her. I need to see her. Was that joyride not enough? She's not taking visitors. She'll want to see me. Is that so? Hmm. Easy on your feet there. We don't need another patient aboard. You sat next to me the whole time? BB did. I'm so relieved. I'm so relieved to know that Wat uh, that healer is okay. She was my favorite. It was very kind of her. Don't flatter yourself, honey. We didn't know what you'd be like. Terrorist and all. They said you were incinerated. Uh, I might as well be. I haven't stepped off this train for... Who knows how long. I've lost track. Hmm. What did they get me for? Too many puns? They said you were... Running dangerous experiments. Huh. Well, that part is true. I know. What's outside? The view. Can't you tell? Not so great. You're right. I've seen better. Are we going somewhere? Finally waking up, are we? I uh, wanted to burn it all down. You got what you wanted. Happy? I'll be back. I don't doubt it. Nowhere to go here except back and forth. Back and forth. Fascinating. Okay, so they've been orchestrating something on a train the whole time. And Secretary isn't dead. He actually did survive. Okay. Um, are you really going to follow me around like this? Um, you don't like it? Did I say that out loud? I've got some new tricks. I promise. And Watcher told me to. So I have to. Okay, then. Good talk. Thank you. He's so different now. The fact that he sounds like an actual teenager is so interesting. The voice acting, like, I, I understand that this game is not, maybe not incredibly high budget, but the voice acting in this game is better than most games. It's so good. Watcher, so Watcher is alive. Watcher? Is it really you? Hmm, it's me. Blue. I guess. I don't sense any activity. Watcher, can you hear me? Hello? Mm. Did you see that? What are you referring to? You didn't see anything? I believe the train is experiencing power fluctuations. What was that? What was it? It was something floating there. It looked like just a copy of myself, or maybe Athena or, or Chris. Did you and Watcher have a good chat? Surprised you're not sick of each other yet? I don't even recognize her. Her condition has been critical for a long time now. The drugs they gave her in captivity? But I was just fine. She was just fine. She may be lucid in a communion, but her meat sack is failing her. Every <laughs> communion drags her system through the ringer. Then why did she... Addiction? 
She's been playing the past over and over, going round and round. I had no idea. She needs to be resting. You should be doing the same. So is the gimmick that this whole time that we've been playing the game, I mean, it said like you've been in communion for eight hours. We've been playing for a little bit longer than eight hours because I've been in let's play mode, but like... That would kind of line up. Is, is this basically the real start of the game? Like everything prior to this was all just a flashback and that's why we had the control over time in the communion? You look terrible. Fixer, I need to see Fixer. That's why we could look at the, the waypoints and stuff. <sighs> Are you even listening to me? Of course you're not. Who listens to Healer anyways? So we've been doing communions within communions and stuff like that, I think. That's kind of wild. You said there'd be no more blood. Vivi, we don't have time for this. We're already on our way there. They know we're coming. You tricked me. We don't always get to choose how it goes, okay? Fixer, I shot her in the head. You did what you needed to do. What you needed me to do. How aim can an arrow from a bow that can't bend? What are you even saying? How about I speak your language? Let the murderers do their murdering. Leave me out of it. <laughs> a pacifist general. <clears throat> you. Good timing. How are you... Oh. Hey, this is my train. I'm asking the questions. Who do you work for? What do they want? Chris. She runs a miscellaneous underground network. I wanted to help. Chris. You know her? I told her to wait. The way the Reds treat us in Old Town. We were done waiting. I was done waiting. I met with the Jows. The Jows? They sent the others to me. They've gone rogue. The Irish fanatics. They helped. They want to clear the way for a second all-mother. Those weirdos? They're involved now? A sister named Doreen. From your time, I think. I can't believe she would go around me like this. I can. All the old sisters are getting picked off one by one. Bartender was shot. No wonder I haven't heard from her. You talked? Not as much as I would have liked. There uh, was a guard. A white guard. Mauve. Mauve? That's her name? Why wouldn't it be? Uh. I saw her in the communion. She was there with Watcher in the cell. She wants to incinerate all the sisters from the last generation. If that's true, no one's in danger. You're telling me they all helped? In one way or another. Shit. I knew something was going on. Why do you think we grabbed you? They cut you out. <laughs> Losers. How'd you know it was me? <laughs> I was following you. I sent Secretary to do some spying on our friends. But what have you been doing all this time? Where are we? I finally figured out these damn trains. <laughs> Pay off from the, the start. We're circling. Never in one place. Always on the move. What's our plan? My plan went up in smoke thanks to you. The ministers were going to overthrow principle. Legitimately. The Red Guard would never stand for it. I was working on it. Things are out of control. I've seen through Watcher's eyes. People need to know the truth. Things take time, okay? They take careful planning. I don't expect a shell like you to understand that. Where are we headed? We're to rendezvous with everyone in 72 hours. They called a meeting. God damn it. Not now. What happened? These trains were never meant to run non-stop like this. Something must have... <sighs> Get out of my way. Mm. Alright, there's nothing over here. Alright. 
Huh. No, no, no. It's only a matter of time. BB, hey. You okay? Do I know you? I'm... blue. You seem uncertain about that. I'm, uh, adjusting. Long communion ring your sky through the iris of an eye? Something like that. So you're the mass murderer? Well... Some... bitter lessons no poetry will ever solve. Why do I know these words? They are yours. I spent time with you in the communion. If you are so acquainted with me, then you must know that I don't trust murderers. That makes two of us. Two murderers who have it out for murderers. Leave me, will you? There was dire and damage enough before you came along. Can I uh, just ask you a question about Fixer and Watcher? No. <laughs> just turn that down, I guess. That's fascinating. You were so mad, but so out of breath. To be honest, it was hard not to laugh. You talk to her? I tell her bedtime stories of the past, seeing as how much she likes that stuff. Can she hear you? Us? The monitors don't pick up any response, but you can give it a shot. Maybe you'll be successful, since the two of you have such a bond. You sleep here? Best that someone is nearby at all times. What about BB? Oh, sleeps too soundly. And fix her? Honey, don't play dumb. How is she? Stable, for now. I think Watcher was trying to share something important with me. Like what? Right at the end, something about that city. The one we left. City? You haven't seen it? I see. Shared all this to a stranger. I was always trying to get her to open up to me. Oh. Watcher, can you hear me? Mm. Mm. Inside sunrise, please. Apologies. This often happens. A mix as old as sweet as. Do you want to tell her a story? Watcher, I think I know why you don't want to wake up, but the train broke down. Fixer needs you right away. You understand? Time is running out. Hmm. Melody? <sighs> I think I'll leave her for now. Let her rest. As you wish. Hmm. No one is beyond forgiveness. Hmm. Whoa. It buzzes. <laughs> Cut it out. Uh, this makes you wonder like what directly affects her like that what if we're caught do you see what I'm saying I'll carry her BB without the meds the equipment I'll carry the equipment she's lived too many lifetimes are you giving up on our sister don't do that remember what our functions have in common both require us to separate our heartbreak from our hand. Well, this is my hand talking. Try again. You are the queen of experimentation. Try something you haven't tried yet. You're overstepping. The sand need only pour once before it knows oblivion. What sand? I have failed sisters before. If you will not, I'll do it myself. <laughs> And I suppose I just sit around and let you make a mess of the place? You probably shouldn't. All right. All right. Let me think. Hmm. Is there something I haven't thought of? What else? What else? Healer? Not now. I want to help. Honey, just leave me. Please. You really want to help? Yes. Then tell Fixer to get herself over to watch her. Are you sure it should be me? I thought you wanted to help. Okay, but what about the train? Tell her she may not have many more chances. All right. Okay. Well, that's grim.
We were never very good at talking to one another. Maybe the easier it was, the harder it is when it's broken. Mm. There was a time I didn't talk to anyone, even my closest sisters. And how did you come out of it? Someone believed in me. Good for you. How long have Watcher and Fixer been like this? When Watcher came back to us, she was in a dire state already. Fixer insisted on giving her an eye. Watcher refused. Fixer pressed on. Watcher retreated. And they cut each other deeply. What was that? Don't think that's for you to know. You were hurt. Skirmishes on the tracks. If you're looking for stories of bloody battle, you should move along, sister. You knew the Minister of Defense? She was a pupil of mine. I remember. If you saw it all, then why ask? Wish me luck. Might need more than that with Fixer. <laughs> You're funny, Bang Bang Fire. I was. Once. <laughs> Bang Bang Fire is actually the character that I think has had like some of the most character growth over the course of this entire thing. And she's just so interesting. She has the silliest name, starts off as kind of like a weirdo. But then she's like actually the like philosopher <laughs> of the group. A mess. Everything is a mess. What is all this stuff? Pieces for a backup pantograph. Bits for a secondary suspension. This train needs a whole teardown and rebuild by hand. We can't be sitting still like this. Do the others help you? Do you really expect BB to have the precision or Healer to have the grit? Machines don't consider your feelings. They'll tell you you're wrong every time. That's their best quality. I just came back from her room. Watcher's not doing so great. What's changed? She's always been so moody. Always trying to get attention by saying nothing. I don't have time for her antics. Healer says there isn't much time left. <laughs> She's always so dramatic. I've got work to do. We're stuck, and who's going to get us unstuck, huh? I think she really means it. All right, little messenger. Tell her this for me. Fuck off. What happened to you on the other side? Is that why you're like this? Is that why you can't face Watcher? <laughs> I'd be careful if I were you. Fixer. What did I say? Fuck off. Okay. Damn. This is like a brutal confrontation. It's hard to like force people to cross a rift that's been torn between them. The sisters are so uncompromising. But also, it's because they're turning away from something. They're too scared. Once in a communion, I experienced this guy pouring itself apart. And it gave me such melancholy. Some sense that all we've ever known is brittle. Oh, sorry. I thought you were healer. I remember this. I experienced this with you. I remember you liked the sound of the rainfall. Huh. I had forgotten about that. For what it's worth. I get it. I spent a lot of my life feeling the same way. Really? Like nothing was right. Like I wasn't doing what I was supposed to be doing. Yes. A shift in the wind can set the sails. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't have said it better. Oh? And can I just say... Knock, knock. Hmm? Who's there? Witches. Witches who? Witches. The best way off this train. Wow. I have to go deliver a message. <laughs> I'll leave you with the rain. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. <laughs> that was quick. I have a message to deliver. Go on. Fuck off. She is consistent, if nothing else. Don't tell anyone, Blue. I'm tired. I'm so damn tired. So many years trapped like this, at each other's throats. Is it wrong that I long for simpler times? How did you escape? The night of the occupant event, nowhere came to us, shaking. 
explained that Watcher got on the train meant for her, that things were going to take a bad turn. BB and I fled to Old Town, and Bartender hid us under the baseboards of the bar. You mean, in the storage? Oh, you know the place. We stashed strange ingredients down there. And that's what we were. There was barely enough room to stand. We spent two months hiding before Fixer found us. Imagine our surprise, seeing the dead come back to life. I didn't know Bartender did so much. She saved us. She saved me too. What do you miss from that time? I miss my station, my lab, having the resources to do proper work, all the shells simply doing their part, calling me Sister Pink. I can call you Sister Pink, if that helps. <sighs> no, thank you. Sometimes just to miss something is enough. Do you regret anything? I used to think I was so above everything. Speaking my mind and my truth as if everyone wanted to hear it. As if doing the same thing over and over again would make it better. Man, that hits true. That's brutal. Even when everything was getting worse. And some people needed to hear something else. I really relate to that. Healer, you need a break. I'm beyond rest, honey. Don't worry about me. You, on the other hand... I'm doing fine. Please. I need someone to listen to me for once. Now hear this. Now hear this. Capital Red, this is Mauve, right? This is a system-wide transmission direct to you, the esteemed High Minister. Sisters and compatriots, this is the High Minister speaking. A brutal attack has been made on our solemn efforts at a sustainable future. I need not recite the damage, but I will speak their names. Vivian, Janice, Vanessa, Eileen, Denise. These were the ministers that served you without a thought to their own desires. Yesterday, they were brutally murdered in an act of senseless violence. Not since the death of the All-Mother have we seen such bloodshed and shared such grief. Yet, there is hope in these trying times. Our principle persists. That's not good. Yes, sisters. She lives. And with her blessing, I have been given emergency powers to hunt down these terrorists and punish them to the full extent of our laws. Effective immediately, all sisters and compatriots will shelter in place. Those who seek to harm us are still at large. Stay inside, stay safe. We will seek no rest and see no night until those responsible are brought to justice. Let the inside sky cast no shadow for these criminals. This is your High Minister speaking. The year is 7 AA. The time is 1900 hours. Gratitude to the Provisional Government. Help! Someone help! Get away from me! Move! Help! I'd rather die. <sighs> She's still living through it. Healer, do something. Wake her up. Shortness of breath, heart palpitations, blood pressure spike. You knew, didn't you? It makes sense now. A knower always knows. You knew what she was doing. Knower's voice must have triggered her. My eye! You took my eye! Help! Someone help! Watcher, breathe. Just breathe real slowly, love. No more. These injections, they make me see things. Please, Blue, say something to her. Watch her. It's me, Blue. I'm right here with you. I won't let anything bad happen, okay? I promise. Noah can't hurt you now. <sighs> You're gonna kill me? Good. Put me out of my misery, sister. How long will this last? I don't know. This is more strain on her system than she can bear. <sighs> Go tell Fixer to come now. Go tell her it's now or never. All right, let's do it. This is so interesting to see it like pass the torch to a new character as well so late into the game, like as all of this is happening. Just like, you know, 
in as much as there's generational trauma in the narrative of this game, like there's, it's like rebellion is like a, a relay race. It's not a marathon. Oh, my daily bother comes around. Fixer. It's now or never. Haven't I heard that before? Dramatic. Everyone on this train is so dramatic. Fixer, you don't understand. I understand just fine. Watcher does what Watcher wants, and everyone pays for it. The Fixer I know would never... Right. How could I forget? You know me. You know Watcher. You know it all, don't you? I know she misses you. You know, while you two were busy reminiscing, some of us were taking things seriously. You heard nowhere. They're after us. They are after you. So have a sense of self-preservation, will you? Leave me alone. Let me do what needs to be done. You can go play nurse with the others. What makes you so different from them? I don't need to answer that. If you don't like it, there's the door. Fine. Fine. I give up. Good. Finally. You can thank me later. So selfish. She just doesn't want to be hurt. Doesn't want to bear herself. And watch watch her die. Hmm. It's sad. Blue. Healer? Oop. No. Watch her. She's awake. Healer gave her something. For a sliver of a second, our sister is back just like she was before. Is Fixer coming? No, I really tried. Never mind, go to her. How about you? I still need a moment. What do you mean? Watcher is dying. Healer says, whatever you do, don't tell her. We have to tell her. Why wake her only to deliver daggers? She deserves to traverse in peace. Please, Blue. These last moments are what she will carry into forever. Don't tell her. Please. Sweet, sweet watcher. How? Oh. How to separate heartbreak from hand. I'm just gonna try to see if Fixer has any new dialogue here if we go back. I doubt she will, but... If she does, that would be neat. No, nope, she does not. Okay. It is time for us to talk to Watcher then. Man, I'm like so gripped. <laughs> it's genuinely hard to commentate this game because it's so interesting and there's so much going on. But it's also so solemn and sad and like contemplative. And I know under other conditions I might be talking a lot about what is being said. But it, I also think with her. this game is so clean in how it presents its information that it's like... What more could I say that it hasn't already said? She needs to know. We can't keep this from her. We can. We will. Any attempt at a communion will end her. Got it? No communion. I got it. We'll wait here. <clears throat> Watch her. We're back together. Finally. You. I'm sorry. Commune. Now. Watch her. Wait. We can't. Secretary. Do it. Wait. Well, <laughs> we had no say. Ugh. These sisters need help. Are we going to go through all of the different places? The different communions that she's experienced in her life? Watcher, end this communion now. There is a you, a you that remains and remains. There is an us with a pattern we are threading. Listen to me. There is a branch, a branch that continues diverging. End this communion. I guess she's just continually trying to uh, <laughs> give us something more. What 
What is over here? What is this place? What is special about this? Why is it this way? I don't know. How do I get over there? How do I do this? There we go. so close and I just walked away because I guess I messed it up. Hey, I said stop this right now. There is a now. There is a now and you are in it. Watcher, we both know you're in bad shape. Me? I'm fine. Here in this place, I feel more than fine. This now. When is it? Healer has been tending to you. She says you're... Then the time is right. I wish she would stop doing that. It's so hard to navigate. <laughs> it's so confusing. Okay. I think it turns them purple basically just for the purpose of this style of event where I literally can't tell which ones I've been to which one I, ones I haven't at a distance without it being purple because of how just insanely ah, crowded it is. It's you. Feels good to stretch my legs. Watcher, can you just stay put for a moment? We're running out of time. I'm glad we can talk. You said we needed to face the future. When did I say that? Hmm. I say that, don't I? You're confused. Time and sequence. These are hard for me now. You must understand. Watcher, why did you give me all your memories? Why did you choose me? I was a stranger. A nobody. Yes. You were without rank, status, function, without judgment. I could trust you with what happened, and then the more time I spent with you, I realized. Tell me, why did you name yourself Blue? Because I felt pushed aside. Ah, Blue, the color of powerlessness. You reminded me of me. I wanted more for the both of us. So I stayed and stayed until we became entangled. And now comes the most important part. Our sisters must understand how and why they are alive. We must help them resist erasure. After what I did, we're at each other's throats. How are we gonna make them listen? Let me show you. Oh God. This can't be good. Okay. These familiars were gifts from the occupants. A way to communicate with them. When I hurt Secretary, they entered a self-protection state. Iris's commands were washed away. I remembered everything. The occupants communicate through referencing memory. Their recall is perfect. Our human ability to remember is pitiful. Secretary, please. Apologies. 
The occupants gave the familiars to Iris, a way to store her memories outside of herself. They serve to ease where human memory is fallible. A single familiar allows for a two-way communion, like we are having now. But do you remember? Iris transmitting to all the ancient sisters at once. The memory of the city. Yes, when all three familiars are present, a mass communion can be initiated. With every living thing in the orchard, the other side, this whole place, we can show everyone all at once what we know. And not only us, the experiences of Iris, her mother, her grandmother, our ancestors, the information in our genetic memory. Will that be enough? I've learned that all change and transformation is violent. Fixer, healer, BBF, they're no match for the Red Guard. There is a way. Whoa, this flung me. I hard zipped. Is it through Zhao? So they communicate through memory. Interesting. We must summon the occupant. What? Iris's familiar has a direct link to the occupant. In the mass communion, you must summon them. I don't understand. Iris and the occupant had a pact. As we saw, she had been communing with them regularly, sharing with them her new memories. In exchange for her obedience, the occupant was hers to command. She used this power to eradicate all the other humans in this place. You can't be suggesting. I am. We must seize that power. There is an opportunity now. I can feel it. Principal may be alive, but she is barely holding on to life. The explosion. Your actions, though desperate, destructive, have opened a path forward. An opportunity of this kind is fragile. You must ensure the path bends toward justice. You're asking me to use that power to kill sisters? I am asking you to make decisions. Do what it takes to protect a future worthwhile. But this is just the same cycle again and again. No. Secretary, explain. When the occupant appears, I will merge with it. You can do that? I... I am an occupant. You... are an occupant. Correct. I am a copy, like you. I knew it. Okay. Do you remember where you're from? Why you're here? No. I was branched without that knowledge. I was made to store and transmit memory, and then to learn your way of speaking. Once I merge with my source, I will remember. And you trust, Secretary? I you will be given administrative privileges Weird. upon my merging. I will make sure of that. We are tools. We will accept your commands. Blue, I have searched for so long. Replaying moments, trying to understand. Finally, I know what has to be done. Principal has the other two familiars. We must get to them. Initiate a mass communion, summon the occupant, and allow Secretary to merge with them. But Watcher, we can do it. I know we can. You're... You're dying. Watcher? Who told you to say that? What? What are you talking about? Was it Noah? Did she convince you? Was it Principal? No. Watch her. Listen to me. They did tell me not to tell her that. So maybe that was a little bit rude of me. All right. I don't know, it just felt like the right thing to say at that moment. Blue has never been one for particular, uh, particularly insidious lies, so, you know, 
just gonna do our best. Where am I going? What is my plan right now? There we go. I don't know where she actually is. There she is. Let's go. Will you stop pushing me around? Know her. She got to you, didn't she? And know her always knows. After I told you everything. Okay, she's on top of the plane. Okay, and then from here, go up here, and then up there, and then right here. Watch her. Stop running. Watch her. I'm afraid she's telling the truth. The truth? What is the truth? Your body is broken. Your mind. This is exactly what they want. For us to doubt ourselves and give up. What do you remember last? I was chained up. Uh, no, that's not right. I was with my parents. Iris's parents. No. I was standing on the other side. Or... Was I talking to Zhao? Secretary, what is this? What's going on? You are scattered across time. Why didn't you stop me? I tried. But every instance, you insisted. Here we are. At Zhao's bedside. The healer warned me. Early on. How many times? Have you lived it over? I don't know. I lost count. 837 incidences. Oh. Out there. What's happening out there? You've been in a daze, screaming in your sleep. I can't stop now. I don't know if it will work, but I have to see it through. I was tricked. <laughs> so easily tricked. This was all my fault. Your sisters, your sisters want to see you. Talk to them, please. It's your last chance, and I want to say goodbye. But I feel present. I am here. I don't want to be a picture. Come on, let's go talk to Healer and Bibi, okay? And fix her. Wait. The night of the dance. Oh, are we going to finally learn what she said to Zhao? <gasps> your mask. I want to pretend. Let me pretend. Okay. Will it hurt? I'm sure Healer won't let that happen. This is where I made the biggest mistake of my life. The world you live in. I never wanted it to turn out that way. I should have done better. We all should have done better. Tried harder. Left you something better. I promise. I will do my best. Secretary will do their best, right? I'm always doing my best. Not here. It's not here. One more. One more. Where'd she go? Bedroom? Nope. Is this when Iris said goodbye? I think it was. I think that's the time we're in right now. Same as a communion with healer. Sometimes your backpack isn't big enough. That's how it goes. Isn't it strange? I've never actually been here before, but everything in my body tells me it's home. <laughs> Thank you, Blue. I'm ready to see my sisters now. I can't wait to see you. Secretary? Yes, Watcher. Lights out. Okay. I'll go get Healer. Watcher? Watcher. 
What did I say about communions? I... I couldn't stop her. Did you at least get to talk to her? I did. Did she say anything about us? She didn't have a chance. Watch her. The train's broken for good, and we can't sit here any longer. We have to go on foot. Watch her. Do you hear that? We're going for a walk. We're not taking a body with us. No. No, that's not right. We're not carrying a corpse around. She's right, Bibi. I can carry her. Let me carry her. No, no one is carrying her. I'm not asking for your opinion. We leave her behind, or we'll end up just like her. Fix her? What? You're a cold bitch. Tell someone who cares. <laughs> you little motherfucker. Don't worry. I won't let them touch you ever again. E free. 